Here's your golfing buddy Bobby Lopez again, and we're taking a look at is it is it Michael? No, Matthew. <laughs> you dumb Cuban, can't you think of the names here? Matthew Wolf and Jim Furyk. Because we look at this Matthew Wolf and say, uh, let's see, let's look at him, take it back, and we say, what the hell are you doing? Look at this. Are you kidding me? Wait a minute. No, I ain't kidding you. Look at that. Almost both right on the same exact plane. Now watch this. He goes over here. He goes over here. He does this. He does this. Look at this. When it's all said and done. Hmm? Let me tell you what, if Jim Furyk ever gets fat, he's done. Because <laughs> he won't be able to clear the way he does. <laughs> now look at this. Now he doesn't clear. Look how he jumps. Look at this. Look how he goes airborne. He goes airborne. Furyk stays stationary. Now, a year or two ago, or a year ago, I would have said, this kid needs to get rid of jumping out of his pants when he hits it because it's going to be risky. However, the way golf is going today, I mean, this this right here, like you say, using the ground. See this? See that? you got to measure. You say, hey, this adds distance, but it adds risk. I could hit it crooked. But in today's world, uh, you look at all these guys hitting it a ton. You, I mean, you almost have to. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Look at that. Push the club right back where you started. Ain't that something? Look at that. Look at that. Let's look at Furick here. Hopefully this camera hasn't moved. Puts the club right back where we started. I mean, come on. Now, they're in a little different position. You, you can see Furyk has cleared more. Uh, here, Matthew jumps. See? Jumps and releases the hands real hard. But look at this. I mean, they're not that far apart, I hate to tell you. Now, what would you do about this? You know what? Absolutely freaking nothing. That's what you do about it. Matthew right here, all you want to concentrate on is tempo, 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 rhythm, 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 tempo, tempo, tempo. Because if you start toying with that whole thing, not on. You know, it's just natural talent. Leave it alone. Here we go. Here, 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 here. Look at that. Look where he's got that golf club right there. Look at that. Look at how he's squatting, and now he's going to, boom. Not only did he jump, but look how he backs up. See that? So until he starts spraying it all over the ballpark, then you might say, okay, I'll tell you what you need to do. Get yourself a big chair with a big back on it like this and put it here like this. And do what this knucklehead does right here. We'll put the back chair right there. Here it is. Boom. Right cheek on the chair, left cheek on the chair, right cheek on the chair, left cheek on the chair, right cheek on the chair, left cheek on the chair. In theory, in theory, this guy on the right is going to be more consistent. In theory, this guy on the left might hit it further. Might. Now, notice another thing. Here's another thing that's really cool. I want you to see this. Now, I'm not saying to do it. I'm not saying to do it. I'm just saying we're looking. Notice something else. Look how close his hands are. Look how close his hands are. Which helps them push it out like they do. Because if you have your hands way out over here, you're going to most likely go back and around yourself. You have your hands in close, you're more apt to go out that way. 
See, but both of their hands are. Look at that. Hmm. Ain't that something? Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> now look, he's a little more behind himself. He's got his hands a little more right outside his head. See, so he gets a little more cross line than Furick does. Watch. See? I like the way Furick does it better, but it doesn't matter. He's not in Furick's body. See? Look at this. And the good thing about a swing like this on the left here, well, he probably doesn't know how to hit it any other way. And that's good. Once he starts monkeying with it, he might ruin the whole darn thing. So I would say until it starts spraying all over the ballpark, leave it alone. So there it is, Matthew Wolf and world-famous Jim Furyk. Now, if you're not sure what your path and your golf swing looks like, what you want to do is just pick up your cell phone. I know you got one. And just take a video of your swing and send it to Bobby Lopez at QuickFixGolf.com or QuickService at QuickFixGolf.com. Either way, it'll get to the same place. And I'll do a complete analysis of your swing and send it right back.